Hello and welcome to the session. The given question says, evaluate integral sin x minus alpha divided by sin x plus alpha into dx. Let's start with the solution. And here we are given integral sin x minus alpha divided by sin x plus alpha into dx. So let us denote it by i. So this is equal to i. Now, next we shall substitute x plus alpha is equal to t. So, on differentiating both sides, we have dx divided by dt is equal to 1. On differentiating both sides with respect to t. And on cross multiplying, this further implies that dx is equal to dt. So, x minus alpha can be written as x plus alpha minus alpha minus alpha and here x plus alpha is equal to t minus 2 alpha. Therefore, sin x minus alpha is equal to sin t minus 2 alpha. Therefore, integral i can further be written as sin t minus 2 alpha divided by sin t into dt. Since dx is equal to dt. Now as we know, sin a minus b is equal to sin a into cos b minus cos a into sin b. Therefore, this can further be written as integral sin t into cos 2 alpha minus cos t into sin 2 alpha whole divided by sin t into dt. This is further equal to integral sin t into cos 2 alpha divided by sin t into dt minus integral cos t into sin 2 alpha divided by sin t into dt. This is further equal to sin t cancels out with sin t taking cos 2 alpha outside the integral sign. We have integral 1 into dt minus taking sin 2 alpha outside the integral sign. We have cos t divided by sin t into dt. Now let us take x is equal to sin t. So this implies dx is equal to cos t into dt. So this can further be written as cos 2 alpha integral 1 dot dt is t minus sin 2 alpha integral dx divided by x which further implies cos 2 alpha into t minus sin 2 alpha and integral dx divided by x is log mod x plus a constant c. This is further equal to cos 2 alpha into t minus sin 2 alpha into log x is sin t so we have log mod sin t plus a constant c. Now let us substitute the value of t which is x plus alpha. So here we have x plus alpha into cos 2 alpha minus sin 2 alpha into log mod sin x plus alpha plus a constant c. Thus, on evaluating the given integral, we get x plus alpha into cos 2 alpha minus sin 2 alpha into log mod sin x plus alpha plus a constant c. So, this completes the session. Bye and take care.